I teach a lot and I love it. I love people, I love seeing people really proud of what they do, um, to see the gratification of actually doing it. Um, I've taught hundreds of classes um, and I teach every day in my own kitchen so essentially that's what a chef's supposed to be as a teacher and a leader and so on so this is a natural thing for us to do. I love doing cooking classes. Usually I do them, they're way more intimate so it'll be like three or four people and you know it's very hands-on where I'm actually like holding their hand and putting it over the vegetables. So many people, like especially downtown, people who live around here, they don't eat at home, they never cook. Cooking is so important to connect you to your community and people around you and actually where you live. What I hope people take away from this experience is to go home and actually cook it. I mean, that's essentially the purpose of it and that's why I don't make recipes too complicated because you don't want to scare people, right? But a chef recipe is a lot different than a home cook recipe. Um, there's all different levels of cooks. These chefs both learned a lot from participating on Top Chef Canada and are moving forward with their heads held high. I really did see myself in a different light. So it's a funny thing, right? Like, I didn't realize how passionate I am about this. Um, and really about how I carry myself and just me as a person. I'm, I never saw myself that way. I'm certainly a lot more tired since Top Chef. I mean, uh, <laughs> since the finale, finally things have um, toned down a little bit. This class is full of people with different cooking levels, but everyone is joining in and getting their hands dirty. I feel fantastic. It's a wonderful night and, um, you know, you get to cook with two great top chefs. I mean, how great is that? You don't have to do a complicated me uh, recipe to make the food really delicious because these recipes are really easy. So you can do them really quickly and most of the ingredients aren't difficult to find in a supermarket, so it's great. I learned that it's okay to massacre your chicken and to get your hands dirty, so yeah. I'm used to wearing gloves at home, so this is a new experience. Yeah. <laughs> Out of your comfort zone. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Cooking should be fun and celebrated and that's what this group is doing.